Hello. Welcome back to this exciting installment of the Alien Gamer Guild. Oh. We're playing We're White Girl. I got something. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Good God, I'm the only sane man here. <laughs> Are you a sane? No, he died, remember? He's a dead guy. He's stupid. I gotta get this sword and shit. Beep beep. 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 Beep beep
there was a lot of controversy over its release back in 2004, I believe. It was, really was it 2003? I think it was I don't remember. Because of the cartoonish graphics and style, it was not really wanted. They didn't really want. Or, I love this. And it, it was because of the poor sales. They were really afraid to release a sequel <laughs> to the game, which they really wanted to do back then. But they were so afraid that because of the poor sales at the time that it had, oh, that's not the one, that they just they didn't want to do it, and so. You know, a lot of people still say this game is one of the first titles in this whole series, and I have to disagree. Yeah, I love the shit out of this game. I love the shit out of this game. I played Ocarina of Time as a child, and then as a child, I also had Oracle of Ages on my Game Boy Color. And then I had Wind Waker. I picked it up because I was like, I was, to be honest, the whole I accidentally picked up Wind Waker as a child. Wind Waker. I accidentally picked up this title. How'd you accidentally uh, pick it up? Yeah. Well, you see, I seen a golden disc out of the corner of my eye at Blockbuster. <laughs> but no, it wasn't Blockbuster. It was, but it was a buy two or buy one for one free or buy two get one free at the video game store that I'd been at at the time. And I'd seen Tom and Jerry War of the Whiskers. Oh, okay. My seven or my eight year old nuts just dropped immediately. <laughs> you became a man. All because I seen that game. I love the shit out of Tom and Jerry. Tom and Jerry's Tom and Jerry fighting. Like Shrek. Uh, that Shrek. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just agree, guys. So I have a tip for you guys. You don't want to be bombarded. Just see target. Oh, you want to. Hey, you mind it. I guess that's only yeah. one. Well, if you see target, the other enemy won't attack you. Yeah, that, that's a. Yeah, that was a bad thing. Oh, greener. I thought it would work here. Hey, look, it's. I'm gonna spoil it. I'm not gonna spoil it. You already spoiled it by saying that you're not gonna spoil it. Say what it is. I don't know. Fucking Minda for all they know. That would be, that would be the weirdest looking thing ever. Right. Nobody comment who. Can you imagine if Twilight Princess had the same graphical style as this? Because when Twilight Princess was a darker game, it wouldn't have worked simply because oh, it was too cartoony for that darker game. I mean, yeah, exactly. If it's, this game hadn't exist with its graphics, then yeah, I we think wouldn't have worked. Twilight Princess, though. But I mean, if Twilight Princess had this graphics, but this game didn't exist with this graphics, I think it would have done worse if be... Twilight Princess was this graphics. Yeah, because the because at least the story and gameplay fit this game in specific. And with Twilight Princess being a darker time like to, to see escape that, or to. Just it's, it's storyline, it's it's art okay. design, it's everything. Speaking of art, it's like complementary colors. Mm -hmm. Wind Wanker <laughs> and Twilight Princess. <laughs> it's happened. Really Wind Wanker. That's gonna be the subject. Here. So they're complementary colors to one another. You can't have the dark without the light. That's true. That's how I feel. You guys can feel free to disagree with me. Hey! Right, but that's my opinion. If you don't like it, well, that's nice. It's your opinion. Hold on. I, I want to hear the music. Oh, <laughs> you guys look like Princess Zelda. I'm so glad. Seriously, I wish I had a. I mean, okay, so I 
I got Skyward Sword when I was in Vegas, and it, it was a long drive back over here. And I just listened to almost nothing but that. I mean, if you like, it'll still be fresh. Exactly. Even if you hate video games, then you're just into orchestrated music. You're gonna love it anyways. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. You know, I think one of my favorite uh, stages in uh, music. Hey. Um. Well, you don't want me to play the same shit. The happiest thing I was, or the song I was happiest to get next to the can can, the fucking like the shit on the can can and always enjoy, um, was the main theme to Legend of Zelda. Not the main theme, but the overall theme to Legend of Zelda. Dun 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 dun. All this dialogue is gonna drive the video to be a lot longer. I guess we can stop here. Why? We're trying to put it in. We can skip the dialogue. Yeah, I'm already Alright, we'll be back, people. Love you. Do stop catching.